The UCLA Bruins are on their way to the Big Ten. They'll have a new head coach and new offensive and defensive coordinators. Uh, the bookmakers aren't very bullish on UCLA. The regular season win total sits at four and a half, yet they will be a 13 and a half point favorite on the road in week one. Is it too many points? Well, we're going to talk about it, but before we do, i got to tell you about a promotion we have available right now at wagertalk.com. From now until August 31st, you can get all my football picks. That's college football, NFL, and NFL preseason for one low price of 249 bucks through the end of September. And why would you be interested in that? Well, I do my homework over the summer. The results speak for themselves. I'm 41 and 12, 77% with college football in August and September, the last two seasons. You throw in NFL and NFL preseason, we're still hitting 75%. You can get that right now at wt.buzz slash deals. That's the Wager Talk deals page. But there is no obligation to purchase anything from me. You're more than welcome to tune in for the free content, get the free picks. The only thing I ask from you is you take the time to smash that like button, and that will allow me to keep on putting out these videos. Let's get into the free pick. We got UCLA at Hawaii. UCLA is a 13.5 point favorite. Total sitting at 55.5. Chip Kelly is gone. The Chip Kelly era is over. Uh, Deshaun Foster will take over at head coach. And he brings in Eric Bieniemy, uh, offensive co coordinator. And uh, kind of surprising to see Eric Bieniemy back in college football. Uh, I thought he was supposed to be the heir apparent to uh, Andy Reid at Kansas City. Of course, he was the architect of the great Kansas City Chiefs offense. Um, it's hard not to be bullish on the future at UCLA. But this season, uh, they're, they're going to miss a lot of the talent they had in previous years. And uh, the offense might be in decent shape with quarterback Ethan Garbers, who started or played in seven games last year, throwing for 1,136 yards, 11 touchdowns, and three picks. Uh, the loss of defensive coordinator Danton Lynn will hurt. The loss of several key starters on defense is also going to hurt. And it's probably going to take time for all the moving parts to come together. And while this will be the season opener for UCLA, Hawaii gets a tune-up game against Delaware State in week zero. Then they're at home to host UCLA. They're getting 13 and a half points. However, this line opened at 17. It's been money's come in on Hawaii. So a little bit late to the party if you like Hawaii. Uh, Timmy Chang's third season in Hawaii. Second season running the shoot, uh, run and shoot offense, and uh, third year for Braden Shager. Last year he threw for 3,542 yards, 26 touchdowns, 14 picks. There was 14 picks. That looks a little bit concerning, but he's trending in the right direction. Uh, his touchdown to interception ratio has gotten better by the year. His uh, completion percentage has gotten better every year. And uh, he, he looks like he's in good position to have a big year this year. Hawaii was 4-3 and three at home last year. They averaged 23 points per game at home. And uh, I, I like Hawaii in this spot. I like Hawaii. I like the over. I'm not going to go with either of those. I will say that I've got a soft spot in my heart for Hawaii as a double-digit dog at home. And one of the reasons for that is back in 2022, I gave out Hawaii on the money line against UNLV in their final home game. I gave that out live on uh, Sports Memo's YouTube channel. That's still up there. You can see it at the Sports Memo YouTube page. And, uh, of course, Hawaii won outright, cashing in a, a big money line dog bet. They were an 11-point dog. And uh, I wouldn't be surprised if Hawaii gives UCLA a run for their money. Like I said, we kind of missed the boat as far as taking the points here. Uh, I don't mind the over as a play either, but these, the way I'm going to go is I'm going to look at the team total for the Rainbow Warriors. We're going to go Hawaii over 21 and a half points. Of course, there's no to team totals listed in the sports books as of yet, but we got the side, we got the total. And with uh, UCLA favored by 13 and a half and the total at 55 and a half, the implied team totals appear to me to be uh, UCLA 34 and a half. Hawaii 21 and a half. And as you can see below, I like that up to 23 and a half. I think Hawaii is going to get their points here in their second game of the season against a UCLA team 
trying to figure things out in their season opener with a new coaching staff. If you like this video, smash that like button, subscribe to the channel. If you got anything to say to me, even if it's nasty, you hit me up in the comments below. I'll get back to you as soon as I can.